Alright guys, so my audio is messed up in this video because I tried to record and also do another webcam, but it, it last time I did the same thing, but it's being weird. I, I, I find alternative use for it. I did. So next time I'll use, uh, you know, the voice with the, the um, image. So either way, I'm fighting this Colleen and yes, um, you know, I'm going ham right now and I figured I'd just narrate over it, you know? Talk about how the match is going and it looks like I e EXP'd him right there because when Colleen's do the hands on hit, they usually tend to follow up with a standing light kick, so I decided to EX Peach, um, get the armor. So now I'm just going in, he guesses wrong on the cross up, gets a dash code, guesses wrong on this one, I stayed in the front, gets EX Peached, decided what he wants to do on wake up, gets stunned, I went for grab, and then grab him again to end the round. Voila. And yeah, KO. So your boy takes the first round, and yas, yas, yep. So skip to round two. Same game playing, you know, trying to vortex her, you know, Colin doesn't really have a wake up attack, um, she has like uh, the parry and she has the, the little the EX back thing, but that's pretty much it. So my goal is to grab her a lot and mix it up with the attacks. But um, right now he did not want me to have him in the corner, so he didn't let me oppress him. So I'm not going to back in the corner now with the EX Peach. Tick throw him right there. I think I go for another one. Yep. And then uh, right here I go for the uppercut he blocks. I guess not. He actually grabbed me. I was wrong. I couldn't remember. That's minus and he gets punished. Yep. And uh... I don't really know what happened. I believe the EX hands is minus four. I could be wrong. But uh, nonetheless, take the first game and yeah, skip ahead to the next match. And we got an Akuma on the same board. Round one, fight. Goes for the overhead chop for no reason. He was obviously trying to hit Casper the Ghost. Goes for a fireball. Another one. You know, I'm seeing he's shucking this plasma. I'm just, you know, mind my business. This guy's name is Gat Like KJ. It's going for the crouching medium fireball. That's unsafe, but, you know, I didn't really do anything about it. Tatsumaki Sun, whatever he says, gets be rustled. And a dash up, or a jump actually, go for the jab jab, but can't remember what I'm doing here. Yeah, because Crush Counter trying to late um, stop that. I think he EXDPs, yep, and I somehow get hit and cannot quick rise. So, I think they did that to make that where when that happens, that the po person is safe. You know, he antires me, I try to jump out. Um, I do kill him right here, this is going to kill, yep, knock him down. And yeah, so, first round to your boy on this new match. And skip ahead to round two, blah. Fight, and you know, he doesn't do the overhead chop at the beginning, but he starts throwing fireballs again. Goes for demon flip, another fireball's coming, get the jump in, punish right there. Um, medium, you know, wasn't really sure what he was gonna do on wake up. Our barrel roll there, slide his dreams, uh, grab him again, uh, go for another one, yep. And then next time I think I go for a meaty. Yep, I was right, cool. Then for some reason that did crouch and medium punch, I meant to do, um, swing but or maybe i don't know what i was really trying to do there so anti um uh he's gonna be a wrestle i guess no i'm wrong ski backdash i can't remember sometimes <laughs> so uh he's gonna activate and i'm gonna predict that he's gonna go for that and i grab him yep the ex fireball i was predicting that and i was like yep he's gonna do it gonna get the read and uh yeah that was quick so fast forward ahead to the next match and we got another akuma different guy this time he's not get like kj he pounds the ground i get the jump and punish knock him down then go for the scoop but I miss, yep, fireball. Um, he goes for that, what are those? He misses. Um, he obviously knows what these shoes are, apparently. He gets knocked back in the corner. Vortex City, I think I go for a command throw. No, he goes for the DP. Um, my meaty wasn't on point right there. I think I went for command grab, actually. I'm not sure. But yeah, so I go for the mic talk. Nothing, no punish. So I back up. Um, I believe I go for another mic talk pretty soon. I don't know if it's this round or next round. or I fought like so many Akumas this video. Okay, he's dead right here. This is it. This is it. Yeah, we got the mic buff too. Dead. Eat ass. There you go. Quick seven hit boys. Um, you know, to seal the deal right there. So let's skip ahead to round two. And I don't know what he's going to do this time. He X fireball. I'll try to dash up. I, I punish him this time. Dash up. I think I, did, I think I go for a media up. Okay, DP again. He's anti on the fuck out of me, but he gets uh, peached in the corner. Yep. Predicted that one, and then he gets stunned here, and I called him Dutch girl to help me out. Teabag him a little bit first, and uh, yep, boom, 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 and that's all she wrote right there. That's game. That was a maximum scaling right there, so any hit after that would actually scale that, and the fact that I had Mike Buff actually helped me out, so on to the next game. Got a geef. This guy was from the Dominican Republic named DJ Eric. I don't know if that's where he's originally from or what, but that was the flag, so goes to the flex. I do go for charge dropkick right here, and he flexes me and grabs. I'm in a bad Oki situation here. He dashes up, goes for running bear grab. I get caught, wasn't expecting it. Fierce punch. 
Um, almost stuns me, but I'm out of there. I'm out of the woods. So there's something interesting that I do um, going on right here. I am about to go ham with some of the dash kill stuff. He anti me, back dash. And here comes the mix-ups. Will we be able to guess right? Cam behind him. Uh, uh, I guess it's wrong. I go for the jump. Ooh. EX throw. He's not stunned yet, but one more attack and he will be stunned. We'll be able to close it out. And I was not able to get the stunned. So, walking back and forth, walking back and forth. Dash up grab. You never expect it. It's just like a snake bite. So quick. I right, dunked this man and the first round was stolen by yours truly. And uh, yeah, so we go into the next round. Yas, yas, real quick. Oh, she says down because it was a close round. So, thinking about this, um, some tech I'm going to use in the second round is a dive bomb tech where you see right here, when you do dive bomb, they try to do that punch, or if you predict they're going to do it, you can get white life and then punish them when you get up from the dive bomb. And I'm going to actually use it again during this match to close it out, but before that, spoilers, I know. Um, he goes for crazy stuff. Almost stunned again. I'm, I'm nearly getting out of these stun situations each time. So I realized that, so I'm backing up, you know, let him cool off, trying to just back up and, you know, get a general idea of what he's trying to do here. So in Deshko, instead of going for a mix-up, I decided to knock him into the corner. Um, then I go for the ballsy meaty right here into the tick throw. And the next time I jump, but I believe I get anti-aired. No, I don't. Okay, so. Right here, here comes the dive bomb tech right here. Watch. Yep. Mm. And he's dead. EX Peach. Yep. And that's the tech right there, guys. If you if you think they're going to do a punch, or if you know, you can just jump, dive bomb, eat the white life, and punish. But yeah, I take that one. And then on to the very last game, we have none other than Mr. Get Like KJ himself again. So... Um, so many of those knees right there. I don't even know what a standing medium kick is. I knock him down. I think he goes for a wake up here. No, he doesn't. So I'm pressing. That was all minus right there. That was like minus two, then minus eight. So plus three. You know, I don't know what that is on block. Fireball. That was really punishable, and I could have got like an Irish whip punish. Stand medium punch an Irish whip, but I didn't. So he goes for that and misses. I, didn't, I wasn't really predicting that he was going to miss. But I did bait the DP, however. So I get the, the knockdown. Oh my god. Calling the desk from behind me. Flip over him. He gets hit. Boom, I think he demons, uh, not demons, but teleports. The biggest stunt. Oh, teabag him a little. Oh, I'm going ham. Damn. Yeah, dunk this, man. That was a very good first round for your boy. Um, yeah, so we pop off a little bit. Round two. Now, round two uh, is pretty tough for me. Not really tough, but I make a lot of mistakes here in round two. So, fireball. Uh, that was a good dive bomb, but double dash up grab was good, too. And then another one. I think he does block this, though. No, he I'll jump with him. Okay. So right there, I should have probably went for a meaty, but I was trying to predict the um, DP because his DP right there would have um, went, went... Oh, if I neutral jump, it would went under me. So so I did that. Okay. Calling dash code. That's safe. We can't punish. It's not plus, but it's exactly safe. Um, he goes ham in the corner here. Keeps me in there. So I end up losing this round, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Yep, another one. Yep. Nice. He did, he did not crack on those uh, fake fake uh, pressures right there. Okay. Ooh, he blew me up for that one. I think I'm um, talking to Mike. No, I actually don't. I really wanted to, but I actually didn't. I was trying to build meter. I thought, I thought he was realizing that, but he didn't. So he does throw another fireball, and I walk forward and block it so I can get some meter. And then, yeah, so I call the dash coin at the wrong time. Got a little too antsy. Goes for uh, Via Rosal to get me out of there. He doesn't want to deal with the Oki. Um, just one grab here would do it, but um, it's going to be very hard to get this grab. I don't know if I'll be able to get this grab at this round. Yeah, fireball, fireball. I just near, if that was full screen, I would have died. It wasn't, though. Okay, overhead. Look at that max range overhead right there. Just, just barely got me. It wasn't even, like, two hits either. So we go to the final game. It's, it starts to lag here. Um, I don't know why it's lagging. It was doing good beforehand, but as you'll notice, it starts to become choppy, and his entire was on point. I can actually tell that um, it wasn't lagging for him, though. And what I mean by that is this game has one-sided lag. So for him, I could tell that it wasn't lagging because he wasn't really... He was on point with his stuff, but for me, it definitely was lagging. So, there's a fireball. Talk on the mic, get blown up for that, literally. He's throwing these fireballs. I jumped that slow one right there. So, you know, anti me again, making bad mistakes. And I'm really doing bad this round, too. And I EX Peach him in the corner. And I don't believe I go for the dash code. Yeah, not yet. Right here, he V wrestles. Yep. And then I go for, like, the golf swing and miss. Because I'm going to golf, golf swing and then wingless, but I missed. So he does go for that. Um, I fake out so he doesn't get the entire. I jump again immediately afterwards. was very risky. I do block, however. I know I have low health. I don't want to die. So I go for the scoop right here. And I think go for the... Yeah, I go for that. The jump in, tick throw, hit. <laughs> and giant swing. And bam, we out of there. So, guys, this is it for me. 
If you guys are new, make sure to subscribe. Um, if you like the narrations, make sure to leave a thumbs up. If you like the video, leave a thumbs up. Sorry the audio was messed up. Not my fault. But yeah, guys, so that's it for this. So peace out, and I will see you guys in the next video. Take care.